Well, volunteer fire departments facing a big threat nationwide as a result of Obamacare rules. Fox Business Network's Elizabeth McDonald is working this story and going to explain it to us. Lizzie, tell us what's going on here. Yeah, good to be with you, Allison and Bill. What's going on is, is firehouses across the country now face possibly having to get health insurance, even though a lot of these guys are volunteers. In fact, about three quarters of all firehouses, firemen, are volunteer firefighters. But the problem is, if they, if they basically work 30 or more hours a week under the law, they have to get health insurance or pay the mandate tax. So already we're hearing that the International Association of Fire Chiefs has sent a letter to the IRS a couple of months ago saying the firefighters should be exempt. Also, Allison, it includes emergency medical personnel. Those individuals are also volunteers oftentimes, and now they may also have to get health insurance. We're going to be watching this developing story. Another fallout also from Obama care we're seeing is those the fire, firefighters who are actually paid money to be firefighters uh, essentially they, they could be hit with a 40 percent Cadillac tax on their health benefits if their health benefits hit a certain standard under new under the new law sending it back to you guys oh boy that is not good news for them ha That's what's right. been the reaction thus far well what's been the reaction so far a few congressmen have picked up on this in Washington DC the firefighters association for the fire chiefs across the country in their letter to the IRS they've already said quote Allison that if they are forced to buy health insurance it could force them to quote curtail emergency response activities across the country. Sending it back to you guys. All right, Liz McDonald, thanks so much for uh, telling us about that. There's